and even milk has naturally occurring uh, sugar in it, lactose, um, can be problematic for um, some of the population. But we'll look at fresh fruit. I've actually heard people vilify fruit because it has sugar. And it's one thing to take an idea and put out a, a plausible claim. Okay, so yeah, it's got sugar. And then, you know, we all know that if you add a ton of sugar to the diet, you lower the quality of the diet, and then you can um, push your bets towards negative health consequences down the line. Okay, that that's fine. That's reasonable. But even though fruit has sugar, it also has a ton of other beneficial components to it. And it's in this low-calorie, high-water, high-micronutrient-density package that is satiating and displaces stomach space for otherwise junky foods that you may, that a lot of people would have consumed instead of that fruit. But beyond all that, forget, forget about all the reasoning and stuff. Let's look at the literature. Does fruit cause negative health consequences? Does it cause things like impaired blood glucose control? Does it cause obesity? Does it cause weight gain? Uh, it does the opposite of all those things. Fresh fruit actually has been shown to improve glycemic control, improve body weight, improve body composition, and improve the protection against a range of cardiometabolic diseases and cancer. 